Hey, theater and friends, it's Jasmine. How'd you like your listening experience? That's what I thought. Just kidding, this isn't the title of show. Fooled you. Today, I wanna to talk about celebrities that I would like to see on Broadway. And I know, like, if a show is like, ooh, look, we have this big celebrity, it's kinda of like, it seems like, we just wanna make money. But I have people that I would love to actually see on Broadway that a, have either proved that they can sing in movie musicals or things like that, or B, just seem like they would be awesome. The first one to me is fairly obvious, and I already mentioned him, I think, in like that England vlog, a Ewan McGregor. I would love to see Ewan McGregor as anything on Broadway. I want a Pride and Prejudice musical with him as Mr. Darcy. That would be to die for. It would just be amazing. Um, I also think maybe he might make a good Fiero in Wicked. I don't know. What do you think? I just think it would be interesting. One that a lot of people might not think of. Okay, I love Christina Aguilera's voice. She's an amazing singer. And just like those pipes, they're incredible. She would be so good as Elphaba. Seriously, I have no idea whether she can act or not, but her singing... It's like her singing Defying Gravity, that would be awesome. Anybody? Anybody think that? I totally think that. Also, just seeing um, Renee Zellweger or Catherine Zeta-Jones in Chicago, like they are in the movie, as Roxy and Velma, respectively, that would be pretty awesome. Okay, the next one kind of will probably make people be like, ew, what are you talking about? You're crazy, teeny bopper. But Zac Efron, Zephron, I just love him. He's so much fun. I think he's a good singer. Like Hairspray and High School Musical, I think he does a pretty good job. And I know he doesn't sing in High School Musical 1, but that's because of it being written for the wrong like vocal range for him. So they got Drew Seeley, who's from Canada. I'm from Canada. <laughs> Okay, but seriously, I think Zac Efron would be really fun. Someone's gonna kill me when I say this, but as Gabe in Next to Normal. I've, I just think it would be really interesting. I think he could probably do it. Maybe even Tony in West Side Story, if he got like shorter hair instead of the whole like emo swoop. But yeah, I'd like, I'd like to see that actually. I think it would be really fun. And he's a freaking, he's a kick-ass dancer. It's always hilarious whenever he dances. I just love it. Also, um, okay. Zoe Deschanel apparently sings. She's, um, an actress and she's in, like, Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy and some other movies. It's like 500 Days of Summer or something like that. I don't really know. But anyway, apparently she sings, and I can't really think of anything specific that I would want to see her as. She kind of reminds me of Sutton Foster, but I haven't actually heard her sing, so I don't know if her voice reminds me of Sutton Foster. Anyway. Okay, I love Nicole Kidman, and I love her in Moulin Rouge, and she's going to be in Nine, which is the most exciting thing ever. Has everyone heard of Nine? Like, it was, it's a musical, and they're making a movie out of it. It's about an Italian film director and all the women in his life. And it's got so many ridiculously great people in it, like Nicole Kidman, Marion Cotillard, Penelope Cruz, Kate Hudson, Judy Dench, Fergie. Fergie. If you watch the trailer and listen to the same person singing, it's Fergie. It'll blow your mind. Seriously. Um, but yeah, Nicole Kidman, as anything... Maybe Diana in Next to Normal. That could be interesting. Another person who I think would be good as Diana is Laura Linney. I don't know if she can sing, but she just, she's a really good actress. And she seems like the kind of person her Diana would be really interesting. There are other people that I can't think of, like, a specific role for them. Like Hugh Grant. I don't think he's incredibly strong singing her, but he can sing. He's in like music and lyrics. He sings. He does his own singing. And that's pretty fun. 
Emma Thompson. I love Emma Thompson. I think she, she, I don't know, maybe she probably has been on Broadway before. She's excellent. How could she not have? Um, Alan Rickman. Alan Rickman. Let's just start naming off the whole cast of Harry Potter. <laughs> no. So, those are some celebrities that I think would be interesting to see on The Great White Way. What do you guys think? Who would you like to see? And don't say Miley Cyrus or the Jonas Brothers. I will kill you. You got that? You got that? Yeah. Also, I heard that there's supposed to be a Spring Awakening movie, and for some reason, there's a lot of talk. I don't know if this is just on, like, Broadway space where I read this, that Miley Cyrus could play Venla. Yeah, that would be horrible. I don't know if that's at all, tr if there's any truth in that, or if it's just a rumor. I'd like to see Lee Michelle play her. As, I don't know, I have this weird thing. I love her voice, but she kind of bothers me. She's fun in Glee, but when I see videos of Spring Awakening, it's just it's weird. I don't know. Uh, but anyway, this isn't about Spring Awakening. What am I doing? <sighs> It's ridiculously hot here. Like, ridiculously hot. It's like 35 degrees or something. I mean, maybe that's not hot for, like, Africa. But it's pretty hot for Canada. We live in igloos most of the time. No, I'm just kidding. Just kidding! We don't live in igloos. Anyway. Bye. Peace and love.